Guys in history of India there are two most powerful empires had passed first Mughal Empire and second Mauryan Empire we already talk about the Mughal rulers in previous video so in this video I will show you the timeline of Mauryan kings. Friends Mauryan Empire was one of the powerful empire of history it did peak its land area was 5 million square kilometers. This empire was founded by Chandragupta Maurya who defeated Nanda Empire and established his own rule in 322 BC after that Chandragupta expanded and secured his western frontier, where he was confronted by Seleucus I Nicator and the Seleucid Mauryan War. After two years of war, Chandragupta was victorious, after which both sides arranged a marriage agreement between Chandragupta and Helena, the daughter of Seleucus I Nicator, in order to maintain peace. Chandragupta married two time in his lifetime first Dhardhara the daughter of the last Nanda king Dana Nanda and his second wife was Helena. From Dhardhara he had one son Bindusara many people said that Dindusara was only child of his but some of historian wrote that he had one more son Keshnik. While his kid with Helena is unknown many historians believe that he had no child with Helena however on the other hand Greek historians wrote that he had also one son with Helena whose name was Justin. Chandragupta reigned from 322 to 297 BCE and was succeeded by his son Bindusara who ruled the empire from 297 to 273 BCE. Bindusara had 101 sons by his 16 wives but most of them are killed by Ashoka except Vitashoka who was the only full brother of Ashoka. Ashoka succeeded his father in 268 BC he is one of the greatest ruler of Indian history he reigned from 268 to 232 BCE. Ashoka had five children, three sons and two daughters but he succeeded by his grandson Dasharatha in 232 BC he ruled till 224 BC and was succeeded by Ashoka's another grandson Samprati. Samprati ruled from 224 to 215 BCE and was succeeded by his son Shalashuka he reigned from 215 to 202 BCE and succeeded by Devavarman who ruled from 202 to 195 BCE and succeeded by his son Shatadanvan he ruled Mauryan Empire from 195 to 187 BCE and succeeded by his son Brahadratha. Brahadratha ruled only for three years and in 185 BC one of his general Pushyamitra Shunga killed him and abolished the Mauryan Empire and established his own kingdom Shunga Empire. So I hope you guys like this video, tell me in the comments what topic you want to see the next video on. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next informative video soon.